Lesson 7, Multi-Digit Quotients, Dividing by 3. Let's go over one example in Part 2. Here, we have 147 divided by 3. So let's use our magic card and cover up the dividend. Slide over one column, and we have 1 divided by 3. Since 1 is smaller than 3, we can go ahead and slide the card over one more time. 14 divided by 3. Will that work evenly? No, so count backwards. 13 divided by 3? No. 12 divided by 3? Yes. If 12 divided by 3 equals 4, then 4 times 3 equals 12. 14 minus 12 is 2. Slide over. Bring down the 7. Can you do 27 divided by 3 evenly? Yes, so write it down. If 27 divided by 3 equals 9, then 9 times 3 equals 27. Slide over. That's the end of the problem. Now let's take a look at the word problem. This star provides a clue that this word problem is related to this division problem here. The word problem says, Tennis balls are sold in packs of three. A manufacturer has 1,074 tennis balls in stock. Here's letter C. How many complete packs can the manufacturer sell? And we see here that the manufacturer can sell 358 packs. Here's letter D. How many tennis balls will be left over? And since there's no remainder, we know that zero tennis balls will be left over.